I want to salute brothers and sisters. Holy salute to the Holy Club. I'm making this video in a tough, tough time in my life. Not even sure what I'm doing. Not sure what I'm saying right now. Even if it'll be helpful or beneficial to anybody. I'm making this video from the bottom of my heart. So let people know that I'm real. Not a phony. Or a pretender. I'm just a person. And I feel pain too. I'm not different than nobody else. Making this video today because today was kind of difficult. But you know, the Bible tells us to rejoice always. Even in our darkest hour and our terrible moments, no matter what we face. It, through it all, it'll be one day worth it to get where we're going. And you know, I got a lot to be thankful for. I got a beautiful family, a wonderful church, and I'm a pastor, and I have a house that's paid for. I have dogs that love me. I've got pets. And I got so much to be thankful for. A roof over my head, clothes on my back, food on my table. But right now, I feel like I am not a failure. As far as living victorious and fighting sin nature. All the things that God would call me to do and call me to be. But I feel like I am a great failure somehow. To people around me. They just either don't want to be around me. Don't get nothing from me. I can't help them. Cause I ain't got money. I don't preach hard enough. I don't teach right. I, my prayers happen, but they too late. I don't know. I'm just asking God for His mercy right now. I'm asking God for his strength right now. And although I would never, ever lay down my mantle or give it up, the thought does cross my mind sometimes. I just want to be a part of the congregation. I just want to be another number. We live, we, we have a small church family, less than 30. And if the Lord don't do something soon, it's going to be less than that and it's going to dwindle. Not going to get into why or how. But some people just want to be a number in church. And you, you can't go to a small church and just be a number. You're going to be recognized and you're probably going to be used or called on to do something, pray or testify or If you want to be a comfortable number, that's fine. I understand that. I want to be asleep too. I want to be Jonah too. I want to run from the calling too. I want to 
be in the belly of the whale. I don't want to go to Nineveh and preach and teach. But we must. We have to. Amen. We have to. Some of us do. And if we don't, the Lord will chasten us and we'll get swallowed by a great fish. I believe this video will come to a close at seven minutes. So, I don't want to push nobody. I want to encourage people. And I don't want to be a stumbling, a stumbling block before nobody. So if you feeling burdened, convicted, or stumbling block in this ministry as you subscribe or listening to the things I preach or teach, or if you think that I'm so much different that it causes you maybe to lose your encouragement or salvation, first let me apologize. My burden's heavy on me too. Sack it. Just pray for me. And third, I'll understand. And if you go to another channel, if you go to another church, you go to. But if at all possible, please pray for me and talk with me or inform me of something. Amen. And uh, I understand what it's like to just want to be a number in 50 or a number in 100. And don't look at me. I don't want to be heard. I don't want to be seen. So until next time, holy salute. In Jesus' name. To the holy club. Amen.